Hi, my name is Sam Lee. I'm 17. I was raised in a town called Dalian in China. I'm a right back and I'm currently playing other than half under 18. I go to school uh, from 8.30 in the morning until my training, yeah. I have training at Ado under 18 every day from 1 o'clock to 3 o'clock. And I have gym before it and also after, after my training. And then I also have my uh, meals, like diet, yeah, throughout the days, uh, almost five times every day. I train almost every day. Well, because I'm still young, so I wouldn't consider any of my moments is the biggest highlight yet. But I would say that my uh, signing contract was a really, really big surprise for me as well. So uh, that would be my uh, hi uh, biggest highlight for now. Football is always something that I love to do in my life. But of course, uh, Dalian had such a great atmosphere for football. So in fact, that's something brought me into this uh, football industry and um, also uh, chasing my dream about football. So. Yeah, I would say that Dalian is definitely one of the reasons that brought me into uh, football. Well, we have also been to uh, Spain just for the trials, but we found that um, uh, the football in the Netherlands is all-rounded. Yeah, for example, if we look at the current football player Frankie de Jong, he's uh, playing in Spain right now, but he, uh, he was raised in the Netherlands and uh, the style of playing football here can adapt into any league around the world. So um, this is also an opportunity for me to get higher level and play in any league that I want. At the very beginning, I was apparently one of the worst in my team. I couldn't really uh, um, be confident and be myself uh, around my teammates. But from all the training, I always did my best and also did side trainings, which means that um, I work harder than anybody else to pursue my, um, pursue my dream. Yeah, I was just doing my best all the time and trying to uh, achieve the level which I have right now. I feel satisfied with, uh, with everything that I got right now, but I wouldn't consider it as a success because I'm not in the actual first team yet. Um, I've also uh, trained before in the uh, Chinese Acad Football Academy and throughout the years they have been developed as to a higher level, such as Beijing, Guan and uh, Guangzhou. They have, uh, they have lots of good players which came from, the, came from their academy. I feel like they have been improved a lot through the past few years. However, uh, players who train internationally, uh, they will feel more competition because there are so many talented players um, in the foreign country. For example, where I train right now, there are just so many players who have potential to become one of the best players in the world. So there's definitely more uh, competition here. And also, um, they um, tend to use more physica uh, physicality which is um, um, something that we have, we all players from, chi uh, from China have to work on because this is one of the most important things that we are lack of um, right now, yeah. You know, I, li I love to listen to music and it's one of my biggest hobby. Uh, I love hip hop. And I also love enjoying uh, companies from my friends, hang out with them. Because you know the pandemic is affecting everyone in the world, we didn't really do much because of the rules and the regulations. But we did have a family dinner all together, just uh, having a laugh. I, w I don't really have one ultimate goal. I just want to um, do my best and see what happens in the future. Yeah, of course, that's always that has always been my dream. I think for every player, for every other players as well, because um, national team is one of the highest level you can achieve in football. First of all, I wish the pandemic is gonna be over very very soon as possible, and uh, because and everyone just get back to their normal life, and this is my biggest wish right now, and and everyone just to be healthy as well, and for myself, I would say that um, I want to get back to uh, playing matches. With, uh, with my team and uh, trying to get the best result as we can.